All right, you guys, what is up? Coming back at you. This is day four and the last day. It should be the last day. Box is pretty much done. I got the port taped off right now so I can paint this white that I've, uh, it kind of got rolled over. What I want to do is uh, once that dries, flip it over and do the bottom. While I'm doing the bottom, I'm going to be working on my Jeep. Um, got some alarm stuff I'm doing to it. I'm just kind of tidying stuff up in there, really. Uh, so, yeah. So, basically, I'm going to give you a quick run over of what's going to be happening in the next couple days. Uh, this should be done. should be in there, and it should be planned. So, I should have a couple videos. Today, I'm going to be working on the alarm on this, um, making it a lot more sensitive. So it goes off a lot easier. Uh, I have my reasonings for that. Also, hopefully soon I'll be ordering uh, a couple more, uh, a couple different sensors for this. Um, I'm not going to say what it is, but a couple different sensors. Uh, so I have a wide variety of them. Uh, but the one I got now, it does the trick. Speaking of which, I better turn off my damn alarm. Anyways, uh, so that's that. I also got something coming in the mail. You should see that when it gets here in the next day or two. And then the build's going to go on a short, very short hiatus. I was going to uh, get some more stuff for my build. But this thing has an exhaust manifold leak. And I've, it's been like that ever since we got it. And it's driving me nuts. I'm basically playing my system at full tilt to hear my system, to enjoy it somewhat. And that's at idle. It's not driving down the street. So I'm going to take the time. I'm going to take a day, a solid day, and uh, I'm going to pull the exhaust manifold out of this and replace it, but that's not going to be happening for another week or two, because um, the new exhaust manifold is like 100, about 100, 120 bucks, and in order to the, get the exhaust manifold, you got to take a bunch of shit off this damn truck just to get to it, and then, uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it, so we're going to get this port painted real quick. Um, I got it taped off. I uh, got this over here to protect from overspray. Uh, go ahead and paint this real quick. Uh, flip it over, do the bottom, and then while the bottom right, guys, driving, are drying, well, got the box built. Subs in. Damn, it's actually a little bit warm. But I uh, was playing with it earlier, and me and my buddy decided we was going to turn it and uh, change how the port and the sub was facing. And originally I had it sub up, port back. Well, I have it sub back and port up. And the fucking results was like automatically noticeable. It's a lot louder in here. The fucking roof's moving like crazy for 112. So uh, here's what it is. Here's what it looks like. I want to drop this bitch down. Here. That's the icing on the cake. Wanna be a hood nigga. I can show you what it takes. 